This is Ian Cameron for Sportsbook Review with your MLB Play of the Day for Saturday, April the 29th. Uh, let's go to the Oakland Athletics-Houston Astros matchup taking place Saturday night. We've got the Houston Astros, a minus 145 home favorite total of 8.5 in this game. Andrew Triggs is a guy that I mentioned uh, in the Wednesday Sports Betting Roundtable show uh, with Jeff Nadu, Donnie Wrightside, Drew Martin, uh, the three of them. I was part of that every Wednesday. Uh, and on that show, I talked about Andrew Triggs as a bet against pitcher moving forward. Look, Andrew Triggs is a guy that was with the Baltimore Orioles organization. And when the Baltimore Orioles, who have not had great starting pitching by any stretch of the imagination the last few years, are cutting you loose, what does that tell you about your ceiling uh, as a major league viable starter? I don't think it says a whole lot for Andrew Triggs. And I know he got off to a very decent start. The uh, sur On the surface numbers will look very good for Andrew Triggs, but he was walking guys, he wasn't getting a lot of swings and misses, wasn't striking out a ton of guys. It seemed like he was starting the season with good outings based more on smoke and mirrors than actual quality good stuff, good pitches and a good arsenal to work with. And I think we saw signs of that in Andrew Triggs' last start, that regression was clearly on the way for this guy. He was not going to be able to sustain what he had done early on in the season. He got absolutely crushed uh, in his last start. Uh, Andrew Triggs was not very good against Seattle, allowing six runs on five hits in 4.2 innings, was chased early uh, in that ball game. Uh, not very good from him. And then you look at his numbers. I mean, his ERA uh, below three at two... Uh, let me just bring it up here. At 2.42... Uh, well, his XFIP is at 4.48. I mean, we're talking about nearly a two-run differential ERA to XFIP. That tells you regression was on the way for this guy. His swinging strike rate last year was above 10%. It's below 9% this season, 8.9% swinging strike rate for Andrew Triggs. He's actually getting fewer swings and misses this season. So this is not a guy I expect to deceive hitters long-term moving forward. And we know Houston's lineup, very potent still, has some quality bats in it. And I think they're going to be able to fare well here against Andrew Triggs. I think he's a bet against pitcher at this point in time. Uh, regression clearly was going to hit this guy. It did in his last start. I think it could continue here. On the flip side, Joe Musgrove is not really a guy I trust. He's a fringe arm at best. He's clearly the weakest starting pitcher in this Astros rotation behind Keuchel, Fires, uh, McCullers, uh, and Charlie Morton. I think he's clearly the worst of, the, of that group for this Houston Astros team, uh, and he hasn't really pitched well uh, as of late either. Joe Musgrove has definitely struggled uh, as well. Uh, Joe Musgrove in his last couple of starts, uh, not very good. He's allowed nine runs on 17 hits in his last 11 innings of work uh, over his last two starts against the LA Angels and the Tampa Bay Rays. Not very good for him there in either outing. Uh, three home runs as well allowed in those last two starts for Joe Musgrove. So the long ball has really, really plagued him. That's not a very good sign either. Uh, now I know Oakland's lineup's a little bit spotty. They're not a very deep lineup. They're not a lineup that you trust to score runs in bunches routinely, but they're facing a bottom of the rotation pitcher here uh, and a chance, I think, for the Athletics to get their bats going. So when it's all said and done, you know, I don't trust Musgrove. I think Oakland can get to him at least a little bit, and I definitely think Houston's going to get uh, to Andrew Triggs here uh, in this game, and the Oakland bullpen not very good either, so they can probably score runs late in this game as well. I don't love the price to lay with Houston. But I do like the total in this game. I think we see runs scored, and that's where we're going to go with play of the day for Saturday, April 29 in MLB. Let's take Oakland-Houston over 8.5. That's rotation number 976. The Athletics and the Astros to go up and over the total of 8.5 runs on Saturday, April 29th. That'll be my MLB play of the day. All right, that'll wrap it up. I'm Ian Cameron for Sportsbook Review. Until next time, enjoy the games and good luck. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to our channel. Now we've put a lot of work into producing all these free videos, so please help us out and keep all our content free for you forever by simply liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Now not to mention a visit to our industry leading website will warm the hearts of all our SBR employees, especially myself. Now the links are over there to the left, uh, so do check those out. Thanks for watching.